Iraqi Prime Minister launches mechanisms for economic reform program. The government previously approved the economic white paper and now has launched the foundation for the reform program. The white paper is a strategy for a modern, prosperous, productive Iraq that invests its enormous potential and human energies, combats corruption, and stops waste, the Iraqi Prime Minister said. Now, we as investors could get all excited about such an article, but hold on. Remember what we learned in the past 90 days. Iraq is ultimately controlled by its constitution, and the constitution includes the religion of Islam, and the country must abide by the rules and policy of the religion. Therefore, what we can hope for is that the value of the Iraqi dinar will go down or up, depending on how you look at it, to create a profit between the U.S. dollar and the Iraqi dinar. If the country goes all the way and provides a revalue down the road, we can and will benefit greatly. But in the meantime, invest a little in gold, silver, and try out the equity share investments and add to your IQD stockpile if you feel strongly about the RV. The word is we will experience a shift to digital currency. This will be Central Bank of Iraq's digital currency. Here we learn the U.S. extends Iraq's sanction waiver for four months. You may ask yourself, so what or what are we talking about? Remember the U.S. placed sanctions on Iran because they were being bad and doing things they, the world and the U.N. said were not good. Thus, to punish Iran, they place sanctions on the country. Now, Iraq gets a lot of their electricity from Iran, and the waiver allows for Iraq to continue to do business with Iran, even though sanctions are in place. Moving on to the IMF, International Monetary Fund, made history when they created $650 billion of free money. These actions are being described as a shot in the arm for the global economy at a time of financial crisis due to COVID-19. The monies are derived from the special drawing rights. In this article, we learn about a 3,700-year-old tablet discovered likely to be the oldest example of applied geometry. This gives you an idea of just how old Iraq is. Istanbul's National Museum has housed the tablet since the late 19th century when it was first discovered. Here are just a couple of notes that you should be aware of. Egypt's president and Iraq's defense minister discuss military cooperation. The other thing you may want to be aware of is that nearly half of Iraq's oil is sold to China. <laughs>